Hi everyone. In this video, I'm going to introduce you to the alerts feature in Ivanti Patch for SCCM. So, let's get started. Ivanti Patch for SCCM provides alerts that notify you of important events. It's important to know when these events occur so that you can take the proper action. Alerts are configured and viewed from within the monitoring workspace. You simply expand the Ivanti patch list and then select Manage Alerts. The available alerts are displayed in the right pane. If an alert is currently active, this checkbox will be enabled. You can see which council machine triggered the alert and when it was triggered. In addition to viewing active alerts, you also use this area to configure the alerts. You can specify whether you want to enable and use each individual alert, and you can also use the severity box to specify the importance you want to place on each alert. There are three different severity levels to choose from. What each level means is a bit subjective, and you are free to create your own definitions. But the recommendation is to think of each level as follows. Informational indicates that an event has occurred. It may not be an actionable event, but rather something you simply want to be notified about. Warning indicates that an event has occurred that could potentially interrupt service if left unattended. And critical indicates a configuration problem that is preventing Ivanti patch for SCCM from working properly. The severity levels are the most useful if you use the email notification feature. So let's go take a look at that. If you click the Manage Subscriptions link, you can specify one or more email addresses that you want to subscribe to this alert. Note that in order for this feature to work, SCCM must be configured to allow email notifications. You can learn more about this requirement in the Ivanti Patch help system. To add a new subscriber, you simply type the address and then click Add. For example, When an alert is triggered, an email message will be sent to all of the addresses you specified in the subscribers list. For example, here's the email I received when the updates published alert was triggered. The user receiving the message can quickly check the severity level of the alert and decide if any action must be taken. The message also provides a description of the alert, some details about when and where it was triggered, it explains why they are receiving the alert and how to unsubscribe if they so desire. And that's really all you need to do to configure and view alerts. When you are satisfied that everything is properly configured, remember to click Save Changes. You can always revert to the default settings by clicking this button. And that concludes this video. For more information about Ivanti Patch for SCCM, or any of our other products, please see the other videos available on this channel or visit our product documentation page. Thanks for watching.